Michigan and beer go hand in hand, and that's why the Muskegon Lakeshore Museum Center is celebrating the history of beer this week. Joining us now is Aaron Mace to tell us more about a special exhibit that you have going on, and you've got a special event that's happening this week as well, right? Yeah, this Thursday night, uh, we're going to have our special exhibit tour, so it's going to be going through our Cheers exhibit that's all about the history of brewing in Muskegon, and it'll be led by myself and then uh, Michael Brower, who is one of the co-owners of Pigeon Hill Brewing Company in downtown Muskegon. So walk us through this. How, how, do, how, will, this, how will this work exactly? So the Are exhibit... Because different, different ex the exhibit's up now, right? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And in people, it's all about the history of the beer making process in Muskegon. Yeah, so brewing in Muskegon goes all the way back to the 1850s, wow. believe it or not, and the first um, or one of the first breweries opened there in 1876 called the Muskegon Brewing Company. Okay. And then there were um, several other breweries that existed after that in different iterations for um, just about 90 years before they finally ceased in kind of the mid 50s. So definitely a long history of brewing there. And what are some of the things that are on this exhibit? That we'll see? So we've got all kinds of different items. We've got antique bottles, we've got glasses, um, kegs, we've got um, different labels and kind of advertisements from the brewery back then. And so there's quite a variety of different things. And so the, the walkthrough is this Thursday. How long is the exhibit in general now? So the exhibit will be up through about mid-May. Oh, okay. Yeah. So people have some time. Mm -hmm. Now, are, are there is there a cost for tickets this Thursday? Yeah. So for this Thursday's tour, it is a five dollar admission. Five dollar. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, what what is it? What, what do you think is our fascination with with beer, especially here in West Michigan? You know, I think there's a lot of tradition with it. As I mentioned before, it's been going on not only in Muskegon, time. but yeah, in Grand Rapids for a long, long time. And I think it's just an industry that brings a lot of people together and just kind of inspires good times. All right, and, and, and you're the lucky one who gets to do the, the tour, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking forward to it yeah. for sure. You, <laughs> it's a tough job, right? Yeah. But someone has to do it. Exactly. Thank you, yep. sir. We appreciate you being here. We've got more information on our website, 13 com, and we'll be right back.